All right, so we're in the back of an Uber uh, here in Berlin on my way to give the keynote for the I Am Festival 2016. And I'm super excited to talk about creativity, technology, and the revolution. Gorgeous theater right in the middle of central Berlin. My talk is basically about creative constraints. It's when your back's against the wall and you, 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 you don't have a lot of options that the best work that you can do gets done. It's when you're the most focused, when you have the most clarity. The same is true with life, with day to day. All of the things that they see are th that are their biggest problems are actually advantages and levers they have. They have unique skill sets and they think that they don't have the right gear. What can they do with the gear that they have right now? I think so many people look at that as a hurdle, but it's actually a creative, uh, it's a creative input and people need to lean into that. So talk, we crushed it. Thank you for all the good feedback on the socials, uh, all the pictures and stuff that you guys sent me on stage, it was awesome. It was super fun to connect with people who are following their path. Like, that was the thing that it was so crystal clear that everyone in this room is, um, is, is tapped into the thing they want to be or become. And that's that energy that I so, I really get off on that energy. I'm always trying to put people on their path. They're wondering if this is what they want to do because they're scared to commit. But when they commit and you're actually on the path doing the thing you want to do, you feel so good, you feel so much more alive. And I always wonder like, what would it be if the whole world did that? That's ultimately my goal, is to put all of the people on the right path, the path that they're passionate about, or their passion, their skills, and their their desire of what to be and become, when all that sort of comes together. I felt that today in that room. And um, it, you just have to follow the thing that's in here. There's something that's in here right now that's telling you what to do. And you're, well, some people are following it, but a lot of you are resisting it. And you have to, there's a certain amount of trust you have to do to just get on that path. But the feeling, the pull, instead of pushing through your day, you feel this pull when you're on the path. And that pull is so compelling. And it's okay if that path changes or evolves or it's, it's like changes by degrees. You used to want to, you wanted to be in a band and then you wanted to be the, the guitarist and now you want to be the bassist. Like that's okay. It's, it's not about like worrying if your dreams are changing. It's the fact that you're always pursuing your dream and you're always pursuing that path. That's what will give you so much uh, energy in your life. And I see so many people missing that or ignoring that part of themselves. Kills me. It's a life mission. Back to the hotel for a little freshen up. I'm not gonna lie to you, the jet lag is like Now headed to the meetup where I'm looking forward to meeting some of you folks out there in the internet land. It's gonna be awesome. And uh, are there any food? <laughs> One of the things about this um, event here in Berlin, and, and basically it can generalize this to all events, is the internet is amazing for connecting people who have like interests you know, from all over the world, and that's incredible. Never before have we been able to connect like that. But there's still something about connecting in person. Um, I don't know, like the idea of networking, or I don't know, it sounds a little bit weird or dirty, but just getting together physically in the same space. It's one of the reasons that Creative Live has people, real humans actually come in when the teachers teach. It's one of the reasons that I go and speak. Uh, I could reach a much larger audience online with a live broadcast than I could by standing in a room full of a couple thousand people. But it's super meaningful because you get to connect, you know, IRL. There's, a, there's something there unmistakably. Um, so many of my peers from across the internet were that that sort of friendship and that bond was really deepened and strengthened at parties and at gatherings um, not like this and this is also an amazing way like a meetup um, to connect with fans and friends and my peers across the creative creative landscape so when possible when money permits and time permits you should be you know proactive about doing these so, things 25 hours please thank you so much sir you can have it.